guys. We are fixing to leave the uh, world's largest truck stop right now. Yeah. There's always a lot of trucks in and out of here, that's for sure. I didn't notice any of the thunderstorms that they were calling for last night, but it's okay. I wanted to get a good night's sleep, and I did. I did have a good night's sleep. The night before I got woken up by a thunderstorm, so I didn't need that this last night. <laughs> Give me a full night rest. Yes, sir. Let's get out of here and go do our delivery. We got 50 miles to go, so it should take us about an hour to get there. We've got to do a little bit of background driving, so let's get over there, over down there. Here we go, guys. We just finished getting unloaded over here at the customer, and now we're gonna put the hammer down towards our reload up in Wisconsin. Yeah. This road is only this one little stretch here where we can drive on. Well, no, since we're empty, I guess I could drive both ways, but... It says it's a 20-ton ton road. I guess I'm empty. I'm only probably about 18 tons, so... I could legally drive on it if I wanted to, but I'm just going to go straight back here the way I come in. I'm gonna go back to the interstate. You know, this machine just got on there. Anyways. Continue on this road for nine miles. I don't know what these guys are doing. There we go, let's give this a try. Let's see if we can get by this guy. Gorgeous area up here, though. I mean, look at this light right there on a on a hill. You know, nice big trees, and that's where the people live. Gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. But let's get out of here. Get to the interstate. Here we are, guys, cruising along on a Highway 11 here in Wisconsin right now. We have about 34 miles to go, and we'll be at our pickup. Oh, look at these beautiful, beautiful fields up here. These farmers looks like they are going to get a good crop this year. It's been nice and wet this year. I really hope that they will be able to get it off of the field too, you know. It just, just doesn't just take growing it. You also have to get it off the field. And I've known from some years it's been either really wet at the end of the year they couldn't get onto the field or frozen you know I mean freezing in it's it's a little bit different but a lot of times it's been too wet they couldn't get into the field you know really hope they will be able to get the crop off this year anyways we're just cruising along and it's a gorgeous day out here today. It's a little windy it looks like today, but other than that, it's not bad. Not bad at all. How many of you guys have downloaded Windows 10 today? Mine is downloading right now. Yep. We'll see if it will successfully download. This morning I tried and it just wasn't downloading and then I was watching some YouTube videos and you know sometimes there's errors and so you have to know how to fix it. So I had to go in there and delete some stuff and then I was able to uh, well it's downloading right now before it wouldn't even download so it's downloading now, so... 
we are in good shape at least for now right we'll see if it will actually download properly and uh, install properly you know I'm kind of curious on how that whole operating system is going to work anyways we'll see if we can get our load on today here we go guys we just finished picking up our preloaded trailer at first on the load offer it said that we we're supposed to uh, do a life uh, load up there but I kind of figured that was a little strange because I've been at that place before and never had to uh, do a life load up there before I was always switch trailers up in there so was no different today just had to do a trailer switch and was out of there I don't know if we have a new dispatcher in there that he doesn't know or or what's going on but whatever matters is we got our load it's actually a really light load too so we'll put our hammer down towards uh, Cambridge Ontario yeah, we'll have to see how, how bad the rush hour traffic will be today in Chicago. Because we're not that far from it. We're literally just across the border, so. Into Wisconsin. Anyways, let's do that and we'll see what uh, Chicago will bring, uh, bring us today. Well guys, it's that time of the day again where we have to end the video. Yeah, we are in uh, Marshall, Michigan. We are done for today. Yes, sir. That's it. I am tired too. It's been a long day for me. But we got to close the show and say goodbye to you guys and uh, hope to see you again tomorrow. So thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you again. Have a good one.